Push there. What am I looking for? I don't even know where I'm going anymore. Purple onion, stand by. Here we have Carl Fatman and Maine and Hastings. And for the Carl Fatman show, here we are. we down, down in front of Water Street in front of the Purple Onion, where it said that Motorcycle Man from Detroit, Michigan is about to take the stage and teach the old school, spread the MC. The room is buzzing inside. Coming from the Carl Fatman show, we have Motorcycle Man about to step on stage. Motorcycle Man, what are we looking for tonight? Uh, a triumph return after uh, I got robbed. You got robbed? What happened? Uh, shindig, that's it. Now I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna prove to everybody this is no uh, novelty act, this is no shtick, this is uh, this is a true motorcore representation, touring, USA, Canada. How has the tour been so far? Tour has been wonderful. My bike is running fantastic. I've never had it run so good. And I'm ready to rock. Are you gonna kick ass in Vancouver tonight? I always kick ass in this city, but they're a little slow. All right, motorcycle man, I don't want to keep you. I'm really looking forward to a big set tonight. I'll catch up with you after. I appreciate it, Carl. Thank you very much. Thank you, motorcycle man. It's JLL, JL Sellout, formerly known as JLS the Destroyer. JL Sellout, how did you become your new name? Well, it was quite easy. It was quite easy with this device right here in my hand. Uh, with this device, you can sell out from any category. Are there any unexpected fees with this device? This device, uh, this device can actually get you into a lot of trouble. So. Can you go deep undercover, JLS, the destroyer, aka JL Sellout? Yes, with this device you can. Are you doing sound for the motorcycle man? Oh, oh, oh. I gotta go. Sound man. Tonight's show. Uh, this is what the town needed, and I came to deliver. I would have to say that's correct. Uh, as any Canada Lynx artist, that's our uh, job to uh, put on the best show we possibly can, and that's what I'm here for. Otherwise, I wouldn't even be in Canada. The only thing I'm reason I'm here is because I'm on Canada Lynx now. The home base is out of here, so I owe it to them, and that is my hometown. What has Canada Lynx Records done for you? Well, they put me on tour, supplied me with gas and tanks, free coupons at Tim Hortons. I'm doing all right. I noticed that you have a new song tonight, and you made some lyrics to I Love Tim Hortons. Excuse me, Carl, I had more than, uh, I had about three new songs. I'm not sure if you're a little that, tone deaf or not. But that is true. Yeah, I had three brand new hits. And one of them had reference to I Love Tim Hortons. Yeah, that was correct. I love you, brother. Oh, thank you, man. Carl Fatman, here we have the Carl Fatman Show. Mark, Mark, what is it that you have to say? I've got to say that Motorcore <laughs> kicks ass on any style. Just like the song says. I mean, I'm. 
going back to the old days of motorcore back in like 78. It's like he's, he's, he's keeping it real. He's got, his, he's got his shit together. That's what I'm trying to say. Can I say that? You can say that. Now you were standing at the back of the bar. You know, kind of a laid back kind of vibe. How do you look at that decision now that the show is over? I regret it a bit, but you know, the vibe just flows through the room. The vibe is as good at the back as it is in the corner. You know, you can be under the stage, you still get the vibe. He's just like, he's just so good. When was the first time you ever heard of Motorcycle Man? I think it was like shortly after birth. I mean, there was, I knew there was some guy out there that it was like just like right for the moment. He had, he had whatever it took. And I knew I'd meet him someday. Right there. Mark, is there anything else you'd like to say tonight in the Carl Five Man Show? I'm out. I'm out. I'm spent. Carl Five. What are we talking to right now? Brian Nazo. Brian, what is it that you have to say? Well, Fat Man, it's a real pleasure to meet you. I haven't. I mean, it's been a long time, and uh, it's good to see you. I I had the treat of my life. It was uh, unbelievable. Here that your band. Function? Yes. Spell F U N K Shun? Uh, yes, yeah, something like that, apparently. Now, I hear you're playing with Roadbed uh, at the Railway Club on August 1st. Is this true? Um, I don't know. I haven't, I haven't heard back from Roadbed, but uh, I, they said if, if uh, we were free, then we'd do it. And uh, I know that me and Function would be like, feel privileged. Do you check your email? <laughs> Unfortunately, right now my uh, computer is on, it's bit the dust. So. Is it possible that you could have not got a confirmation that was sent to you and not realized it? Well, that's a possibility for sure there, Fat Man. I, also, I moved in it, so I've been kind of difficult to... Um, it's, it's unreliability. A position that you find yourself in um will you be at that show oh august 1st railway club opening for roadbed you better believe it baby that's good It wasn't what I expected, no. So in fact, maybe you weren't expecting anything. No, I wasn't, so he definitely exceeded my expectations.